Good morning everybody and welcome back to another day. It is a Botox day today. I'm going to get my lines. I'm going to get them all washed away basically. I want no lines for when I go on holiday. I want to be frozen. Anyway, we've just been and picked up dog food. We're going to take that back home and then we're going to nip to Meadowall. I've got to go get some what they call them shoes, wet shoes, sand shoes, shoes that you go in water with. I've got to go and get some of them, go get my Botox and then see what rest of the day brings. I have to sit up for 12, for six hours, so we might go on a road trip. Mike's not interested, he's just, he's just in his own little world. Anyway, I'll see you all in a bit. Right, we've done. Oh, oh. Wow. Right, we've done. We're on his way home. Uh, I asked for a bit of filipino in my lip, but he couldn't do it because we were too busy. Uh, but the woman that went in before me must have had all sorts done. Uh, she got numbing cream all over her face, and it it, it showed in about forty minutes. My appointment were at like 12 o'clock and I didn't go in while 20 past 12 but I've got like a hole here, a hole here holes up all over my forehead holes in here, I've never known him be as quick uh, doing, my, doing my Botox like I have a really 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 bad headache where he's just like gone in and shot the stuff in What did he, how much did he put in I don't know. Fringe. Three three areas of Botox, and I'm like, it didn't go in middle of my forehead. It went round outline of my head, and then down middle ear, and then it's gone down sides of my face. I am contemplating going somewhere different uh, because people are just going in and just asking for certain stuff doing. There were a woman coming in, there were a woman just come in and sat down and she were like, and then a fellow went in and asked if he could do it and he said yes, so she sat down and filled the farm in. Whereas I was there waiting and it was a good 25 minutes, 20, 25 minutes, me sat waiting. Anyway, we're gonna go home and we and our Scarlett and Isabel's probably gonna go out because we might just go to a traffic centre again, but there again we might not, who knows. Right, we've come out, there's our Isabel and there's our Scarlett, she's driving us and we're gonna have a drive to Trafford centre because I have to sit up, well, seven o'clock tonight. I've got to, I can't lay flat with my head. It's got, to, I've got to stay upright. Uh, I've still got a little bit of thing at either side uh, I've just done an Iceland delivery to come today at five, between five and seven. So Jamie and William's gonna take that in. Uh, so yeah, so we're gonna make our way to Trafford Centre and then we will see what we can get. Tesco's. Look, is this mine? Yeah. All of it. Well, unless you're just gonna have a cup full. Right, I'm back. Right, Botox. I think you can see the little dots that I've ended up with. He's uh, done all up here. He's done all in here. And he's done a bit in here. So, Botox done. I don't know why I've got a red nose. Might have got a little bit of a suntan on my nose. Anyway, I haven't been for my hair doing yet. Uh, I've been to Tesco's and I've picked up some of this. Bright Reveal. Uh, Post Acne Marks. So I'm hoping it gets rid of these spots. Sun spots, edge, edge spots. After, clean, after cleansing, apply three to four drops on your face and neck followed by your usual moisturizer and the minimum SPF which I have got I use this one 
and I also use uh, this one this is factor 45 SPF whatever it's called but I'm gonna have a try at that see if I can get rid of this anyway we've been to Primark sports direct this morning so I've got two bags from Trafford Centre and a bag from Primark from Sheffield and then the Sports Direct. Now the Sports Direct bag is just some swim shoes because I don't know whether it's going to be pebbly or what. So I've got them for me and blue for Jamie. So they've got to go into case. That's the last thing I needed. Uh, right, meadow wall. Right, so I got some high waisted. High waisted leggings. I uh, got these in an 18. I've got them in an extra large. So I got two pair of high waisted. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-one, I wear long tops anyway. So anyway, so two I wasted. And then I got three, uh, the three pound ones. Are these three quid? Yeah, three quid. I got these in extra large as well, but they are a good stretch. And potentially they could be see-through, but I just got the normal ones. And I got these in extra large. So I got three of them. But when I looked at my receipt, she charged me for four. So I went back in the shop and they just said, oh yeah, get one and take it. So I went in and I got, well, I bought three. She scanned four. So I went and picked an extra one up. So I've got four of them. So that's six new pair of leggings. Uh, I got a extra large, extra large, uh, stretch vest top i've been waiting for these to come in uh and i and i and i i thought do i get extra large or do i get extra extra large just for bagginess but i thought no because by the time i need the extra larges i might be another few pound a few stone lighter so i got i got gray cream and they were £2.50 so you can't grumble so I've got cream beige uh, and a white an extra large and then I just got this like blouse to chuck on uh, if I go for a drink front beach type of thing so it's it's like a throw over and this war this were eight pound I got in an extra large because I don't have to have buttons fastened on that so that's a last thing for all of uh, I got some strawberry mints and a face brush facial cleansing brush yours with warm water and your favorite facial cleanser so instead of using my hands so I got that and I got them they were from Primark at Millwall now we went to Trafford Centre Scarlett wanted some Cinnabons so we got some Cinnabons uh, we got some cookies out of Selfridges, we got some water Voss, uh, plain not fizzy fizzy uh, fizzy and not fizzy Fizzy and not fizzy. Two bottles of fizzy, 
three bottles of normal. And then we went into Primark and Vans. So our Isabel's got some uh, new socks. So she's got size four to seven and a half and five and a half to eight. So she's got white, black and checkered and she's got tangerine orange, brown and pink. So that's what she's got in them. So these are just navy blue with cuffed bottom. So I got a, I think she's got two of them. Yeah, she got two of them cuff bottoms. Uh, you don't want to see. You don't want to see underwear, do you? Of course you don't. She wears boxes anyway. Right, and then we got a. a it says I don't back. And then it says this on front. So that's just a baggy t-shirt for her. In black. And then we got one in like a mint green. I think these were eight quid. So that on the back of that one. And then quite nice actually. So that's that one. Uh, and then she got this one this were eight pound as well montego bay and then it's just a thing up front quite nice these and then i picked up uh I think this is like a green colour. This is an extra large. Uh, I think it's like a like a light like mint green. And I just thought we've been coming up to summer. It's just a t-shirt that I can just throw on with some leggings. Oh no, that's beige. That's a beige, and this is like a green one. Uh, and I got them in an extra large, just for bagginess. And I should imagine that they will be baggy because sizing her lately in Primark has just gone really, really weird. Like o oversized and oversized. So that's that. And then I saw this. I don't know whether our Isabel will wear this or not, but this is a extra large Disney. Uh, Lizzie McGuire, is it? So I got that. And then our Isabel, I got her this. Uh, 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 what is it? ACDC. So she's got that, that's a really baggy top. In fact, that could be a nighter. It's that long, comes to knees. So that's Isabel's and then she got uh, Rolling Stones. So it's that on front and then on back it says uh, the Rolling Stones 1978. Isabel weren't even born then. She weren't even thought about our or five. I had to count on my fingers then because I forgot what year I was born in. And that's everything that we got from Primarks in Meadowall and the Trafford Centre. So I'm going to take all the tags off, bag it all up, go give them to Isabel. Not got a clue where she's going to put them. And that's it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. I have got a little bit of a headache. Uh, I can still move my eyebrows 
Uh, I did. I, went, I did go in for. I did ask him if he could put me some filler in my lip. Because when I smile, I've got no lip. That's why I tend to. So I don't show my teeth. But he couldn't do it, and then he wanted to put me a millionaire, a millionaire, a uh, millionaire, to get rid of my lines. And I was like, I ain't got time today. I've got loads to do. I've just put Isabel's new bandage on because her legs popped again, like really popped as well. It's, I think I'm gonna end up having to take her back to hospital because I think it needs, it either needs some steri strips pulling together, but it's that tight. I don't know whether they've, what you call it today, but I'm hoping to get it sorted before we go away. So if it's still no better tomorrow, I am gonna take her up to hospital tomorrow but I'm going to keep an eye on it tonight because if I take her up now, it's late. It's like 20 to 8. But the time we've been seen, it's going to be like early hours at morning. And then if the water have, have to have her in, she would have to go back on Monday anyway. So I've padded it up. She's got pads on. I have got some, I have got some wound strips, uh, wound closure strips. So... If it comes to a point where I have to put some of these on while I go to hospital, that's what I'm going to have to do. But I have my, I have my little, <laughs> I have my little box of tricks for her. So we've got some Micropore tape. I've got some scar gel for her. Uh, we've got some tube grip that we've got on a leg at minute. We've got some large uh, adhesive uh, things that's got sticky stuff on. But at minute we're used to using the sterile pads and the tape because we only tape round three around three of it because it's connected to other type of thing uh, so yeah and i've got some fast healing plasters if i have to put a plaster on it so that's my little box of tricks for isabel that's up in my bedroom uh, i am going to look on amazon because i have a bit of growth I have a bit of growth on my nails. I have been using my stuff and it does taste vile. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it all off, put some stuff on and then put some of that off at top. And if I go like that, and it does taste vile, trust me. But my head here is so sore, it's unreal. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and I will see you in another vlog.